the question is a very straightforward question they have asked to identify the instrument and the instrument over here is what we are is has a very characteristic feature that we need to identify and it's very easy to derive the answer so if you can see it has a long shaft rather the handle and it has a 90 degree curvature over here in addition to that you can see two beaks that are present at the end of the hand, end of the instrument so even the only two options that we could probably look at over here would be either an obvigeezer retractor or an l shaped retractor the answer for this question would be the obvigeezer retractor all of these instruments that you see over here the c shaped retractor the devers retractor obvigeezer as well as l shaped all four of them are used to retract the soft tissues away from the mandible in most cases difficulty is up to isolate the mandible or the region to work on in the mandible is much more difficult than in the maxilla because you have the tongue and you have the other soft tissues which are more actively involved in the region of the mandible as compared to the maxilla however in the maxilla one of the most important difficulties that you would identify is visualization because you cannot use direct visualization in a lot of cases so the l shaped retractor or the langenbach's retractor is basically just an l shape it is exactly l shaped it looks like this retractor only but it's just that the end is straight and it is used to retract the cheek as well as sometimes it can be used to retract tongue the c shaped retractor is like this and that is also used for the same purpose the obvious retractor in addition to the l shaped it has a notch at the end of the instrument and this notch is used to insert itself in the region of the ramus anterior border of the ramus of the mandible so that you can place the re retractor in the region of the anterior border of the ramus of the mandible and it will lock on so if this is the anterior border the instrument locks itself over here and when you retract the mandible you can retract it easily and the instrument will not be easily separated and help in proper retraction because in other cases probably the instrument can easily come out of the mouth whereas this provides some form of stability and that is the advantage of this instrument